Nice. Hey guys, welcome to my channel. Today we are going to check out this Radiator Springs Racers Signature Puzzle 1000 pieces. This is the fifth anniversary of Cars Land and I was going to get this possibly on eBay but it went for about 50 bucks and that's why I did not get it. But the last time, just before Christmas, that I was at Disneyland, I saw it there. So let's check out each of the sides of the box and then the back. So here is one side of the box, and I'm flipping it around here. If you need to pause this video at any time to check it out closer, you can do so. One thing I did want to say is that this puzzle is 27 inches by 18 inches, and it is the Disney Gallery Attractions series. I have several other Disneyland puzzles on this channel, so if that's something that interests you, you might want to check that out. Now we're looking at the back of the box, and it has the puzzle there, and it says, inspired by the Disney Pixar film Cars. Cars Land is home to many attractions, shops, and restaurants located in a replica of Radiator Springs. Cars Land was opened in Disney California Adventure Park on June 15th, 2012. And in case you're interested, I paid $24.99 for this puzzle at Disneyland. Of course, I got the 10% off because I'm a pass holder, magic key holder. But other than that, it's $24.99. Here is the completed puzzle now that we're checking out now. And as you can see, they've got several cars. Each of these cars in the parks and in these puzzles can carry up to six people in each car. If you have not been there, that is how it is at the parks. Also, if you are not familiar with the ride, when you do ride the ride, you are actually racing another car. And here it shows them side by side. In the puzzle and that is why as you look at this puzzle you can see many different things you can see the mountain range in the background those are the Cadillacs that are standing up on end those are the ends of the back end of the Cadillacs mountain range Cadillac range and then in front of that you've got Willie's Butte and then you've as you can see the road is winding through here my understanding is that these cars at Cars Land are basically the same cars that they have at Test Track at Walt Disney World. Um, I have not been on Test Track, so I don't know. Either way, if you have not ridden in this attraction at Disneyland, which is actually, I say Disneyland, it's actually at California Adventure. But if you have not ridden on this ride, I recommend that you do. Sometimes the line can be rather long, but uh, it is a fun ride at that. So now we're going to check out here the puzzle more in detail up close as you can see there's also other cars up there closer to the top of the cadillac mountain range there and there's that little bridge also that's that you see there in cars land i do enjoy buying these disneyland puzzles and the attraction posters that they represent and they are a lot of fun but i'll be honest with you that i did very little on any of these puzzles that you've seen if you've watched them on this channel my son is the one that is quick at doing puzzles. He can, always has been, even as a little kid. He can look at a piece and almost know where it goes, or in many cases he can. And he does them very fast. And that's another reason why I get them. It's something fun to do with him, though I am much slower than him. And he enjoys doing them and what, as well. So here you're looking at the bottom corner of the puzzle. It says Cars Land and it's got the Disney California Adventure logo there. If you have never been on this ride, I will tell you, you start out in one spot and then there's two different paths to take. One is Luigi's and Guido's and the other side is Ramon's. And I won't tell you anymore because I don't want to spoil it for you, but both sides are really good and the ride is awesome. We are back looking at the entire puzzle. I hope you have enjoyed this video. If this is your first time, make sure you do subscribe, hit the notification bell, and put a comment down in the comment section about your opinion of this puzzle and what puzzle would you like them to release. See you next time, guys.